What's up everybody? Chris with South Carolina Gun School. Today we're going to talk about the range bag from Proper. Welcome back everybody, and like I said, we're going to talk about the range bag from Proper for all the ones out there that are needing a range bag or maybe needing to add another range bag to the repertoire, depending on what you've got going on with your gear. So uh, give me a second here, I'm going to get the uh, camera adjusted to give you a better view of it. Alright, so here's everybody a better look on the uh, range bag from Proper. Uh, it is... 10 inches wide, 15 inches long, and then 9 inches deep. You got your Velcro here with your little zips for the top part here. Also inside you've got some Velcro on each side if you have uh, anything that it will Velcro. Plus the Velcro also is for your dividers here. You get two dividers to go down inside so we'll set that up here shortly of course you have your padded shoulder strap if you would like to use it and this thing is padded as well inside the bag on each side even the bottom here so to give you a look kind of down on the inside so you can kind of see in fact, let me throw the dividers in here and you see how they open up the Velcro. And right there on the side. That side, that side. Again, you don't have to use both if you don't want to use both. It just depends on what you're doing and what you're putting down in here. That's with the dividers in so you can get a good look at that. What that's going to look like. Got the shoulder strap over here. And you've got the little D ring hooks to attach the shoulder strap. There's that, of course, your swivel. Can't even get this thing up. Huh. There's your shoulder strap, and it'll slide wherever you need it to slide. And you've got a pocket here on the side for anything you need to drop down in the pocket. The other side, as you can see, you've got Molly attachments. So if you've got something you want to attach with some Molly attachments, you've got that available as well of course on the front here you see you got a place to put some patches and then this pocket opens up you can see there's your mag pouch and then you've got a little zip mesh here for anything so again there's a spot for your magazines and then you also have another pocket back here and with this pocket you've got some individual pockets in front of it as well too and it does just like the other one zips all the way you see it folds out and then in here you've got another
another mesh pocket to store stuff in. You get a little fold out mat and this will Velcro in and just extend this little front pocket piece out. And also you have this which you can use for just about anything. You can put um, lubrication down in there, pins, uh, depending on what size gun you use, you could probably put some extra mags down in there. Metal Velcro, this is will take anything with Velcro, so you see that old Velcro right there, just like that. And then like I talked about with the pocket here, you see this thing will Velcro onto the front part of that pocket and just it lets you extend it out. even more. So there's that all laid out and you can just unvelcro it and use it for something different. But you see this thing has enough pockets, enough velcro and enough molly for you to be able to really attach anything that you like. I was looking at a few other range bags and was lucky enough to get this as a little bit of a gift and again down the side there spot for your patches and stuff or whatever you want to put on the front so this is a very very nice bag I'm going to put the uh, link in the description below going to Proper's website as well as a link directly to uh, the range bag so you can take a look at it again it's uh, 10 inches wide 15 inches long nine inches deep and just a, a very very nice range bag to be able to get you to and from the range or you know whatever you want to turn it into it's just an excellent bag to uh, have so definitely go in and uh, get this checked out uh, it's very inexpensive i think it was 50 60 bucks somewhere around there but again i'll have the link in the uh, description below it's not too expensive so please go in take a look at it and check it out folks and always remember, if you're not shooting, you're reloading. If you're not reloading, you're fighting. If you're not fighting, you're dead. Train to live. See you on the range.